Welcome to the pool house and this is Mr. Randy's kitchen. Today, we have the bed today. Today, we're going to peel some potatoes, cut them into juliennes, and then cut them into batonets, or what I would like to call french fry cuts. We are going to begin by peeling the potato. So here is a peeler. I've shown this to you before. So what we're going to do is we're going to just press down the blade on the potato and then we're going to rub the blade on the potato. Rubbing it from the inside going out. Be careful with your point finger. You do not want to peel including your finger. As Also, make sure you are ready with a trash bowl. Even a empty gallon of ice cream will do. So what you want to do is insert the tip or the point of the blade and then turn it around to remove the dot. That is your peeled potato. First we're going to cut the potato into juliennes. But before doing that, we would like to cut a flat base out of it. Because since it's a rounded object, it's going to be warped, it's going to be moving around when you cut it like so. So what you want to do is, we're going to cut a flat base. To create a flat base, you can choose a side that you'd like to cut it, and we're going to just cut off a portion of it. You are not going to throw this away, we are going to use it for later. So that is your flat base, so make it stand on its side. Put it on the side, first 116. Let's try it again. Try a third one, and then you can put them together, or you can you can work with them one by one. So I'm going to do two at the same time. These are your julian potatoes. Next is your batonet, or what I'd like to call the french fry cut. So, first one for the see the, see the see the french fry. The same technique, you're going to cut strips out of it. As you can see, you can already visualize the french fry. These are your potatoes cut into batonet or your french fry cut. 